What's happening, my Pokey people? It's your boy, Pokey Perk. And today, we're going to be filling up more pages of my unorganized Pokemon TCG binder. And as you know, we left off. And it was around $693.74 ungraded. And today, we got some more cool cards to put up in this binder. No rhyme or reason to how I do it. I just do it. You know what I mean? So, without further ado, let's get it. All right, my pokey people. So the first car we're going to stick up in here is the Hoopa EX from Pokemon Raging Surf. Stick that right next to the Zardy boy right there, which I'm very proud of. It took me forever to get that thing. You know what I mean? Next up, Charizard EX Hyper Rare from Pokemon Obsidian Flames. We'll put that right underneath the Chunky Boy. The Charizard Chunky Boy, that shiny boy. Then next, Arceus V-Star from Pokemon Brilliant Stars. See if I can get that in that sleeve right there. Your boy Fat Fingers everything. And then we have Alakazam EX Special Illustration. This card's crazy from Pokemon Scarlet and Violet 151. And then we have another Brilliant Stars, Luminian V. I have the alt art. I don't know where I put it, or that would be the one that I put in here today, but it is what it is. Then we have some Pokemon Crown Zenith, Electivire Galarian Gallery, with Magmortar there too. Very pretty, brilliant card. And then Pokemon Obsidian Flames, Houndoom EX. Very, very nice. And then, I'm pretty sure this is some more Crown Zenith. But we got our Gumballs and Berries and our Greedent V. I know it's a pretty basic, common, bulky card. But it's still a hit, right? So now we're going to flip the page and we're going to start on the next page. More Crown Zenith. Kyogre V. I have about 400 of these things. Just chilling. I'm probably going to end up giving away a whole bunch of cards, but... See if I can get this in the sleeve. There we go. And now, more Pokemon. Scarlet and Violet 151. Psyduck Illustration. That card's crazy nice. Crazy. I mean, I wish it would have got an Illustration Rare with Misty or something. That would have been really cool. And then more 151. We have Gollum EX. People are starting to use this card more and more in the, the meta decks on PTCG Live. I haven't used it yet, but here's one of my favorite illustration rares from 151. The Ivysaur with the Bulbasaur Water Reflection. That looks crazy. Stick that in there. And then from the Pokemon 2023 Holiday Calendar, we have the Glaceon VMAX. Very nice with the special festive stamp. And of course, it came with also a Glaceon V with the special festive stamp. These cars are brilliant. I like them. I like them. I mean, they're they're just reprints from Evolving Skies, but got the stamp on it now. And I pulled this Mew V from Fusion Strike out of that holiday uh, calendar as well. And all these videos are on my channel, so you can go ahead and watch them if you want. And then we have, I don't, I don't know if it's base or if it's uh, Paldea Evolved, but we got the Oinkalone EX. I'm pretty sure it's Paldea Evolved. I have about 400 of those too. And then also from Paldea Evolved, your boy pulled this Chien Pao EX Full Art also out of the holiday calendar. Oh no, this is Paldea Evolved. It says it right there. The other one is Scarlet and Violet Base. Very cool. Okay. And then from Astral Radiance, we have Hisuian Decidui V. Very cool. Very, very cool. Also, Astral Radiance 
trainer gallery cleaver how cool is that the trainer galleries are like undefeated I like them better than illustration rares most of the time but it is what it is we moved on and then a radiant radiant Greninja I think that looks so good I like the radiant cards I can't wait to see what the scarlet and violet shining treasures has for us and then Lilligant V star Tell me if you guys miss V's, V Max's V Stars down in the comments. And tell me what your favorite card is that I'm putting in this binder today. And then we have Origin Form Palkia V Star. This card I use quite often in my Chim Pao deck, as do most people, because of the ability. And then one of my favorite cards from Brilliant Stars. Rapid Strike Urshifu V Max. I don't even know where this card came from. I didn't even know I owned it, but I'm happy I started organizing stuff in my bedroom and bringing it down to my girlfriend's makeup room and whatnot. But that's brilliant. And it's from Brilliant Stars, no pun intended. And then Pokemon 151. We have Mew EX. Beautiful. That's a, that's a pretty expensive card for it to just be a basic EX card, not even like a full art or anything. Then we have our Streetwalker. Jinx EX. I like the card. Got the kiss of death, as uh, my boy Clay would say. I'll put his at down in the description. Then we have Wiggly Tough EX. Very underwhelming card, but it's going to get a spot. Let's flip the page. Also... I pulled this from the new 2023 Lore Ball, Del Fox V. Very nice. I'm pretty sure that's Lost Origin. I have a hard time getting stuff in the sleeve sometimes. And then, Obsidian Flames. Illustration Rare Hound Hour. How nice is that card? Wish we would have got a Hound Doom, but it is what it is, right? I have it in Japanese too. I don't know if I already put it in here or not. I gotta look. Victini EX Obsidian Flames. Very nice. I like how these sleeves just fit right up in there too. Also Obsidian Flames. Coridon EX. Coridon EX. I pulled that as a double banger with... I want to say the Ortega Full Art, but... I'm going to make a Full Art Binder. Tyranitar EX. Very nice. Very, very nice. And then a beautiful illustration from Obsidian Flames. Gloom, the same illustrator as the Magikarp and the Brute Bonnet to come out in Paradox Rift. How nice is that? Look at that. Some of the art for these cards are unmatched. Another beautiful card. Nine Tails Illustration Rare. Look at that. They should have made it shiny. It would have been way cooler, but... It is what it is. Come on, go in. There we go. And then Obsidian Flame still. Absol EX. Beautiful. I don't know if I have the full art or not. I know I know I pulled it for my brother, but I'm not 100%. And then now we're moving on to Pokemon Raging Surf, which I just opened a booster box I won on Instagram from Shige underscore Japan underscore TCG. Check them out. Bombardier EX. Very beautiful. Now, Cyclazar Illustration. This is a lot of people's chase card. Your boy pulled it. I pulled the top card being Parasol Lady as well. The video is on my channel, but I'm going to make a full art and like all that trainer card binder by itself. Grass Terra Frostlass EX Pokemon Raging Surf. Guys, hit that like, drop a comment, subscribe to the channel with notifications. Tapu Coco EX, Raging Surf. If I can get it in there, there we go. Another beautiful illustration card. I guess art rare in Japanese, but the snore run. Look at him chilling in the snow, smiling. Very nice. Very cool, I pulled the frost last two. And then I didn't know this, this was a Pokemon, but the minier illustration rare, art rare. Very nice, very vibrant. And then, last but not least, Water Terra Garchomp EX. 
very beautiful. So let me go ahead and add this total up. And go ahead, hit that like, drop a comment, tell me what your favorite card is of this video. Subscribe to the channel with notifications to support yo boy. Peace.